During certification flight tests, the turboprop engines TV-71 17ST01 for the regional aircraft IL-114-300 completed more than 250 flights, totaling over 2,000 hours. These engines outperform their foreign equivalents in several ways and are developed and produced by Rostec businesses in collaboration with the United Engine Corporation. In takeoff mode, they generate more power while maintaining good fuel efficiency in their class. Oleg Yevtushenko, Rostec's executive director, stated that the engines have demonstrated dependability, economy, and efficiency. UEC Klimov engineers are still optimizing the design and software of the TV7117 ST01 to ensure even greater reliability and service life. The IL-114-300, developed on the President of Russia's orders, is intended to replace outdated aircraft such as the An-24 and the ATR-42 or 72. It will improve regional connectivity through modern digital technologies and wider use of composite materials. The aircraft can operate from poorly equipped airfields with dirt or concrete runways. The TV-7117 ST-01 turboprop engine produces between 2,500 and 3,000 horsepower at maximum takeoff power. In emergency power mode, it can reach up to 3,600 horsepower. The engine weighs less than 500 kilograms and has a specific fuel consumption of less than 200 grams per horsepower hour. Its modular architecture includes nine replaceable sections and it features a modern FADEC digital control system. This system improves fuel efficiency and provides proven reliability backed by more than 2,000 hours of certification testing. The engine is certified for flights up to 7,600 meters in altitude and is designed to modernize regional air travel in Russia and neighboring regions. It was developed using Soviet-era technology, which Klimov JSC and affiliated firms updated to meet modern standards. In comparison, the popular Pratt & Whitney Canada PW100 engine family includes models such as the PW127 and the PW150. The PW127 produces roughly 2,750 horsepower, while the PW150 can reach up to 5,000 horsepower. These engines are heavier, with the PW150 weighing about 717 kilograms. Their specific fuel consumption is around 263 grams per kilowatt hour. They use a three-shaft turboprop design with two spool compressors and a reverse flow combustor. PW100 engines have extensive global certification and are widely used in regional airliners such as the ATR and Bombardier series. They also benefit from well-established maintenance networks and extended service intervals. The latest PW127 XT version allows up to 20,000 hours between overhauls. The General Electric CT7 engine, though mainly a turboshaft for helicopters, has turboprop versions operating in similar power ranges. It is known for reliability and versatility in both military and civilian use. Overall, the TV7117 ST01 is competitive in power and efficiency among regional turboprop engines. It is lightweight and has advanced digital controls, though it mainly serves the Russian market. The Pratt & Whitney PW100 family has a stronger global presence, higher maximum power in some variants, and a longer operational history worldwide. Still, the TV7117 ST01's demonstrated flight hours and ongoing upgrades prove its reliability and efficiency for Russia's regional aviation needs. This comparison highlights the TV7117 ST01 as a strong modern option in turboprop aviation, offering a balance of power, efficiency, and ease of maintenance. Meanwhile, at the UEC Saturn plant in Rabinsk, preparations are underway for serial production of the new PD-8 turbofan engine, which produces 8 tons of thrust. This engine is designed for the Superjet 100 passenger jet and the B-200 amphibious aircraft. The PD-8 is undergoing certification tests, the final stage before mass production. The engine incorporates modern Russian materials and advanced technology, 
building on the expertise from the PD-14 engine for medium-haul aircraft. According to Deputy Prime Minister Denis Manturov, the product is expected to be in high demand. In addition, UEC Per Motors is carrying out the Development Impulse 3.0 project, aimed at improving productivity and efficiency in aircraft engine manufacturing. The project includes advances in mechanical welding and assembly workshops, which will increase equipment use by 50% and cut preliminary work time by 80%. It will also speed up tool production by 25%. Assembly shops will reduce equipment setup times and use universal tooling, lowering part manufacturing times by 15%. These improvements are intended to deliver genuine economic gains while continuously seeking better production solutions. Thus, the Russian engine building industry is making steady progress in developing advanced aviation engines and improving manufacturing processes. This ensures serial supplies of high-tech domestic products to aircraft manufacturers and strengthens Russia's position in the global aviation market. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Also, please take our channel membership, which is very affordable, to encourage us.